Hello everyone. Welcome to Talent Open Studio for Data Integration. In this tutorial, we will take a look at T Replicate component. T Replicate component will take one input and it can give multiple outputs. So it is very much same functionality as T Map. T Map similarly can take one input and can provide multiple outputs of the same input. <coughs> Let's take the sales order data source as our input and then we will split the data based on the region. So we will be loading data to different files central to one file, east to one file and west to another file. To accomplish this task, we are using tReplicate component. So these are the inputs and this is the output of the tReplicate component. We are sending all the columns that we are receiving from the source. And there are no other additional features available in T replicate component. It just replicate the input data to multiple outputs. So it will send all the source data to the T filter row component. We named it as central. Similarly, to east and to west. And we are using context variables in this scenario to filter the data. So we have created context variable east, west, central and file directory. So east will have the value east, it's nothing but the region east, central and west. We have created the context variables for the three regions. Let's go ahead and open the component. So we are selecting the input column region and we are saying it should equals to the context central context variable. So this is how we call context variable within the component. So similarly for east, we are calling context variable east value. Similarly for west. So at the runtime, this particular context variable will be replaced with the actual values defined here. Similarly, for the output files, we are using the context file directory and then the file name. Because the directory will remain the same, but the file name will be changing. So we have create, we are creating three files: central, east, west. So the east file should have total thirteen records will be going to east flow. Let's see the total record count for the west flow. So here we have six records. So six records will be going to the west flow and it will be creating a file. And we will be having these six records in that file. And this is a directory we are provided in the context variables. And the folder name is orders underscore region. Orders underscore region. So here the three files will be created. Let's go ahead and run the job.
so as discussed six records went to rest six records went to rest and 13 records 13 records went to east and the remaining 24 records went to center values has been replaced by the context variables defined in the t filter component as well as t file output deleter components let's go ahead and see the files In this file everything all the region is related to the center so, so that's pretty much it for this video we have used t replicate component and also we have used context variables and we have seen how to use the context variables so t replicate transformation or component will take single input and it will replicate to multiple outputs the other important thing to monitor here is all the links we have connected to the three different t filter row components are treated as main so only this transformation and tmap component can give multiple main links rest all other transformation will have only one main link so that's pretty much it you all have a wonderful day